guys oh should i say hi guys hello my wonderful people and welcome back to my channel dom here welcome back to my channel so i was watching youtube no surprise i had this inspiration from watching nerd forge what is her name i'll put her name on the screen i keep forgetting her name but she did a um she did a challenge where she completed a sketchbook over 12 days i kind of want to do that but not in 12 days i want to do a sketchbook to start off the year and hopefully by the end of the year i will have at least one sketchbook or maybe two or three filled um i kind of have this thing where i get a lot of sketchbooks and i don't finish them it's not that's not very good you know it's not very good for practice it's not very good um to show off my skills you know because it just shows that i like to just quit things so what i'm going to do is start a sketchbook i'm going to use um this strathmore art journal that i got and it's from mixed media um this was like 10 bucks um if you haven't watched my sales video on how to get cheaper notebooks um you can because i think this was like 30 bucks and I got it for 10. Somebody just marked it down and put it in the bin and I went right to the clearance bin and found it. So you can find stuff when you want to. But um, yeah, this is a mixed media art journal and it's only got 64 pages. Now obviously, if I'm sketching at least one page a day, 365, we're gonna shoot for that, but I don't, I don't know about that. But if I'm sketching, Obviously, I'm going to be able to fill this up. So that is one of my goals. But I also got this Artist Loft. And Artist Loft is kind of like a cheaper sketchbook um, thing that you can get from Michaels. Usually, um, they sell them in other places. But this is a really good um, sketchbook. I think it was only like five bucks at the most uh but yeah it this one is 110 sheets and it's acid free because over time you know things age and you don't want it turning yellow and then making your pages look yellow but the paper is very very i already drew something on one of those i got a different one i'm gonna do for this but the pages are very smooth and if you don't know like paper weights and all of that type of thing just touch the paper touch it feel it rub on it do all of that stuff um and then you can you know figure out what type of paper you want if you don't know like paper weights and all that other stuff um but yeah this uh mixed media paper from strathmore this is the 500 series so they use better paper i think the last mixed media paper i talked about was yeah it was xl which is through canton Oh god, I love the way this front smell feels, but like it's not their best um paper as far as smoothness goes. So it can be a little whack trying to use different things on it because it's made for acrylic watercolor pen and pencil. And just from my experience with that, it doesn't do very well as far as like color pencil and crayons and stuff and that's from my last video about the Crayola crayons and color pencils more on the color pencils but if you want to check that out I'll put a link above but anyway yeah I just thought maybe a sketchbook would be a really cool thing to do and I'll probably walk you through my first page I don't know what it'll be so if you like this type of thing be sure to give me a like if you want to comment something or give me an idea of something to draw maybe i'll like put it in a future video you can put that in the comment section i just want this to be like super chill super laid back and it'll be fun and also i will be uploading way more because i have succeeded in getting an ipad <sighs> i'm so excited it's Jimin. I'm sorry. It's always going to be like Jimin or Yingi or any anybody. Anybody in BTS. Oh my god. But yeah, so that has enabled me to be able to upload more and learn more and all this other stuff. So let's get started. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you 
if you haven't already i can't speak and let's get on to the art i still hope you had a fantastic day um staying safe and washing your hands and all of that we got you know more covid going on bts got hit with covid i just got my booster the other day that crap hurts and i almost had like a fever in it and my family was trying to like help me rub it out it was so terrible but i don't know i had a decent holiday it was nice i got to see like my family and all that other stuff and tell them that if bts goes on tour that i don't care what happens i'm gonna shoot for front row seats so i have to get back started on making the outfits and hopefully show you guys how i actually like create like my own outfits because if i can't get it from korea or japan or anything of that nature because it's, it's hard to get and then sometimes sizing is hard but if i can't find anything that i want from over there i usually just try to like make some clothes i try to get like small business brands and all that other stuff because they make really good quality clothes but it's so expensive so if i don't want to go that route and i feel like it's cheaper to just buy some fabric and add to something or rip it to shreds and start from new i usually do that so maybe i can show you guys how i do that in a different art video and i'll probably label them differently so it won't be so confusing <laughs>
Hi guys, so I just wanted to pop in and say, um, yeah, this video is it. Um, I forgot to film like a final look, so here is the final look. I just finished the shading and I wanted to keep this kind of simple so I didn't ink it. Um, I'm still working on other sketches and all that other junk, but... I hope you guys are having a good March going into April. My April is going to be crazy. It has been hectic and I am super duper excited to share more things. I know it's hard for me to get stuff up, but I want to be able to share more things and go at my own pace. I know like the algorithm doesn't allow for that, but like my schedule and working it's just freaking horrible right now but i still want to share my artwork and how i'm thinking and feeling and stuff because you know we all kind of go through the same things and you know we just don't talk about it and i feel like this is a way for me to talk about it so you can see like my rise to art glory i don't know why i did that don't maybe i'll cut that out maybe i don't know okay but anyway Please give it a like and thank you so very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye!